Okay, guys, so is this the end now of our journey? Heaven's Ward? So that's the ending of Heaven's Ward. All right, the last quest. Let's go. Welcome to the flagship, Master Momoyoko. You're almost at your destination. Bloop. Warning. Intruders detected in the vicinity. Please eliminate them if you wish to proceed. Ah, oh, we are being ambushed now. What? Defeat the enemies that appear. So... We have to go through this tun tunnel here? You, everything is so freaking... Technological here. Alright, let's go in here. Deactivate the terminal, so... Let me guess, he will activate them and we must defend him. Warning, intruders approaching. Where? Oh, here. <laughs> Just freaking Imperials. That's no threat to me. Just some weaklings. Look, like I said. I don't even break a sweat from this. <sighs> but they are stubborn. Yo, I hate being interrupted constantly. What is this? Speak with the guidance note and defeat the enemies that appear. Yep, we did it. Area secured. Lifting access restriction to the ethorochemical research facility. Restriction lifted. You may enter the facility at your leisure. Ending guidance. Oh, wow. We're gonna enter some laboratory now. Unknown energy source detected within the etherochemical research facility. Please exercise caution. I am pleased to have been of service to you, Master Momoyoko. Please send my regards to Master Wedge. Deactivating. Bloop. Alright. The etherical research... Okay, let's, let's queue for that. Let's get in. Need to stop the freaking Archbishop and the rest. There we go. Oh shit, nine minute queue. That will be a while. <laughs> dum, 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 dum. Let us please in. We're waiting so long. Can we please get in? Queue takes too long. I go with the rhythm. It really sounds nice. <laughs> no, like, seriously. Like this instrumental here. This freaking theme is one of the most catchiest ones in Final Fantasy XIV. I like it. Can we please get freaking in? I've been waiting here for fucking 12 minutes already. Almost 13. Like, come on. What is up with the queue today? It's freaking afternoon. Like, people are supposed to freaking play at this time, right? At least here in EU. Yo, what the heck? What the heck is this? I'll quickly jump there and see. Is that like a... A Sphinx? Should we fight that? You know what? I'm bored. I'm just gonna fight this. Let's fight this until we can get in. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Ha! Dodge this. You understand know, all this thing you can do? Ooh, it survived it. Easy mode, easy mode. How's the queue? Finally we can get in. This was our warm-up. Let's go. Please, I hope this dungeon has also cool music. But usually they all do. So let's see, what's the cinematic here? So that's the laboratory. Ooh. This looks like a raid almost, more than a dungeon, right? Wow! The freaking LED spiders and shit. The etherochemical research facility. Let's get ready to rumble. Let's go. 
Hi folks. Alright. I was about to write in chat warn me about mechanics please. Alright. Let's go full AoE mode. Ooh. That tank is taking a lot of damage. I, st I think we're still gonna be fine, right? <sighs> this AoE feels so freaking smooth on the Red Mage. Like, I, I love the AoE skills that the Red Mage has to offer. And it feels so smooth. I love it. Ooh, wow, so many freaking cyborgs! What are they called? Clockwork Hunter! Yeah, this reminds me now of Elder Scrolls Online, because we have freaking clockwork there as well. It's nuke stuff. What's going on here now? Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Now I'll push myself, t uh, pull myself to this one and use my freaking melee AoE. I think this one hits hard too. Boom. There we go, there we go. Kamui, me, cheesy cheese, and Septimus Symponekos. Well done. They have a good group, I feel like. They feel so smooth. Magitek Venka. How did those Imperials get in here? How, how comes they are in here before we get in there? There's no way. Mechanics. Oh, this Hydr. What is his name again? Regula Van Hydrus. Like his his name sounds quite female, like right? But he's a male. But I guess it's Latin, so it has a different sound to it. Maybe I'm thinking too too English on that. Nope. Okay, we don't have any. Holy shit! Why is he freaking targeting me? Leave me the heck alone, dude. I already kicked your ass earlier. Why are you even going up against me again? Dude, it's crazy. Dude. Now let's go big dick damage midi mode. Boom. Oh, there's a freaking turret. Let's, let's nuke this one. Dude. That's another one. Holy shit. Why are we... Almost walked into that. Hey, to be careful, dude. Holy shit. In the name of the Emperor! In the name of the Emperor! What are you talking about? Okay, we almost got the first boss. That was too easy. Okay, he escaped. Maybe he will appear again. Like from the lights, this uh, reminds me of this uh, one one raid actually in in WoW. Like there's one with like dwarfs, like me mecha dwarfs, right? Like the ancient ones. And, like one looks a bit like that too. I forgot the name of this raid in WoW. It looks a bit like that. Easy mode. 
Alright. We've almost done it. Let's go big AOE mode here. Oh shit. It's actually funny how how easy this is. I would have actually thought that the further you go into the expansion stuff gets insanely difficult. But it still feels pretty much the same from difficulty. Or it's maybe me just getting a bit uh, more fluent and better at the game. And having a good group that freaking maybe carries me a bit or something. But so far I find this too easy, guys. They only come until this thingy is still there, right? So if, if you like DPS this one out, they no longer spawn probably. Wow, I have to give the theme of this also like a 10 out of 10. It sounds so epic. It's this kind of theme that you would hear in a freaking movie when you are like marching to war or something, right? Okay. Are this time any weird mechanics here or something? Holy shit, did that one just transform into something else? Or are my eyes playing tricks on me? Holy shit. Oh yeah, that's a freaking transformer thingy. Now it's a freaking naga. Like the nagas of freaking wow. Holy shit. Oh no, a stun right now. Ah, screw that. Healer, AOE heals please. What's this now? Holy shit, so many arms. Is that its true form? Did it just reveal its true form? Uh, yeah, I'll definitely grind some characters in this dungeon. It seems fun. Easy mode. Well done, guys. What's funny is we are performing so well, but we are all sprouts. So from what I've heard from the lore, so the Imperials basically stole the elegant technology, that's why they are so advanced, right? Whoa, whoa, we're being ambushed here. Yo, is that a boss fight? No, it's not. Oh my gosh. That was a close call right there. Holy shit. Ah, one of my teammates got hit pretty hard. Yo, there's no space to, to move around here. So crowded. Ooh. 
Like, I'm impressed at myself right now. I touched every single thing. Like, I never took damage. You guys saw my H HP bar. Like, it never freaking moved, right? Holy shit. I think soon I have this game in my blood. And then the same thing will happen, like, in Elder Scrolls Online. Where I will, like, uh, do the hardest uh, content. Like, my goal is to get on a level where I can beat, like, freaking ultimates. There we go. Let's nuke it. Oh, I think it's so cool with those platforms, how they are like making a bridge each time you wipe certain mobs. Wow, cool. Cultured uh, Shapti. Let's see how cultured they actually are. I think I have a new favorite dungeon. This is so fun here. Love it. Now the platforms again. <gasps> what is this thingy? What is this globe there? Holy shit. Is this the reactor or something? Are we going to the reactor room? Colonel Conjurer. Another cultured shop tea. Ha! I used my skill to dodge this. Like, I love this skill uh, displacement. Like, sometimes I actually on purpose wait a bit longer and then use it because I know I can uh, dodge a freaking mechanic that way. I'm doing like a, a freaking backflip here with that. Ah! Okay, I was a bit too late. But barely did damage, so. Okay, the path does lead to this uh, room there. That's probably the last boss. Mapping the room, Aethero chip. Okay, we didn't miss a room. Holy shit, what is this room? Final boss incoming. Wow. <gasps> Those are... That thing is alive. Are we are fighting the Ashens now. What? The champion of Hydaelyn. Ah, I don't like the sound it makes when they're walking Tell on that. Me, why do you despise the primals? They are the embodiment of mortal will, of mortal desire. But they're draining the ether and destroying our world. To despise. And tis well that you do, for it is from the vortex of ceaseless conflict that Lord Zodiac shall be reborn. Lord Zodiac. Through the joining, the world shall become whole again. Then all shall be as once it was, as it should ever have remained. I disagree. For the glory of Lord Zodiac. Ooh. Your meddling ends here. Uh, am I, are we going to fight two bosses at once? 
Yep, yep, we are going to fight two bosses at once. Holy shit. La Habria and Eogur. Darkness shall consume light. Oh shit. I was about to ask, are there any mechanics here? They already started. Holy shit! Holy shit! Take this! Oh, screw that! Holy shit! Ah! Oh. Where must we go? Oh wow. We can actually fall off here. Holy shit! You can't move. I can't freaking move here. Okay, okay. Ice is gone. That's good. Holy shit. What now? It's over already? I've been working out a lot, okay? I've been training freaking hard. Like, I grew a lot from when we first missed. Are they going to do like a fusion or something? Just like a freaking Dragon Ball? Like fusion! Is that, is that what's happening? They have the echo too. The power to break down the barriers of existence. Holy shit, they can use the echo. I didn't know that. Don't tell me those are fallen uh, champions of light. No, that can't be. Oh wow. Phase 2. Just like Dragon Ball! Holy shit! Wait, if a female and a male are merging, does it not lead to a transgender result? <laughs> no, 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 uh, wait, what, what's the word not transgender? What, what is it when someone has like uh, both genders at once? What's the word for it? It's like on my tongue, but I can't. Like, I don't remember actually. By gender. I just call it by gender, okay? This thing is freaking by gender. Holy shit, this looks badass now. Oh wow, phase two. Holy shit. He will summon two ops we will need to kill and he will summon portals we need to jump in later. Okay. Okay. Alright, I got this, I got this guys. We're gonna, we're gonna be fine. Easy peasy lemon squeeze, you're gonna do that. Let's go, let's go. Okay, which one first? This one. Or this one first. Oh wow. Okay, so that would have been uh, a freaking wipe if you would have not dodged this.
Okay, so those are the portals, and we have to use them later. Or now? Okay, it didn't work. Okay, he's almost down, he's very low. Uh, this again. Use my freaking combo. Oh, oh, what, what now? What is this? What is this? And now? Oh, screw that. Why can't you? Now I can use skills, okay. I don't care. I go big, deep damage. Okay, there we go. It's over, guys. We defeated this thingy. This demon or what it is. There we go. Duty complete. Wow. I didn't die a single time. I'm impressed. I thought I would die. Easy. Uh, since you're the only one left, I commend you. Okay, let's go. Ah, uh, the Archbishop was not here. I thought we would encounter the Archbishop here. Where is he? Ah, uh, they're escaping. Oh no. Ah, okay. The fusion is over. That he might regain the blessing of light I had foreseen. But he has grown so strong in it as to deny us our power. Yup, I became very strong. I leveled up. Let us withdraw, Lahabrea. That power remains to us, at least. What is this? What is that? Impossible. Is it just her? Or is it also La Habria we are going to trap now? Who did we... Who did we catch? Oh, it's her, not La Habria. And now we are... <gasps> Okay, one Eschen less. That's great. But I could have foreseen it that this would be not uh, Lahabria, but the other one. Because I'm pretty sure Lahabria comes at the end. But Lahabria is a bigger threat. We should have. Wow. <laughs> Okay. Two Ashen so far. You're next on the list, Lahabria. So, you harness the eye's power. A pity you spent it all. What will you do now, hero? Yeah, those so, were two. 
Not even the vaunted warrior of light can unmake an Asian without relying upon mortal contrivances. Oh, there's the Archbishop. Holy shit. What are they holding there? But we did undo an Asian, so... What is this? What's in this box? In the distant past, King Thorden and his knights twelve fought and defeated Nidhogg. Yeah. Though the victory cost them dear, they were rewarded with a great prize. The dread worm's eyes. Both of which have seen. Yeah, but one is gone now since we used it up. I mean it's still there, but I'm not sure if it works though. The eye you possess was Nidhogg's left. And long has it served as a source of the Azure Dragoon's might. Oh, I think this one actually still works. I thought it was all spent. Didn't he say that? Wait, is he not evil or good? I'm so confused about this Archbishop guy. to the person of Haldreth, the first, the first Azure, Azure Dragoon. Dragoon. For though he learned to harness its power, he was ultimately consumed by it. Even in oh, death, shit. Body decays not. That's why he looks still for a fabled hero. alive. My Asian friend, long have you and your kind sown the seeds of chaos by teaching mortals the secrets wait 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 so archbishop is actually good or what if you assumed that we would meekly serve as your pawn then you are great oh, he's actually betraying the essence now you would raise a hand against us By taking unto my flesh the soul of the legendary king. Oh wow. So Lahabria will also be a god. Tell me he can turn into a primal. Oh. Holy shit, I didn't expect that. What the fuck? Wow. He's using the power now from the eye to create light. The Azur Dragon disappeared. You can turn him into a freaking sword! I didn't see that one coming! Oh, he looks badass. And the eyes nigh bottomless reservoir of ether. What? Your contempt for man has proven your undoing, Asian. For my first act as God King, I do hereby sentence you to die. We escape. So I feel like that like, real. Whoa, 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 whoa. No. Was that really enough? No, he got trapped. I think. Shit. To be honest, I would have rather had the Ascians as enemies than this guy now. <laughs> Fuck.
and bring order to the world. So he became like a crazy guy now, what? They are leaving? I see now, so the Archbishop, he has like his own ideals and, and motives and stuff to do things, but he isn't like a completely evil guy, I mean, otherwise he would have freaking attacked us or killed us on the spot, right? Holy shit. The Singularity Reactor, oh wow. So, so there's a part 2 and with a waiting time of freaking 10 minutes. Yeah guys, we will do this the next time. That's it for today's video. This was like really really freaking fun. And I can't wait to fight against him. So be prepared for part 2, it's coming out very very soon. And yeah, I wish everyone a wonderful day. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. And yeah, stay all safe and healthy. I will see you guys next time.